the world famous Jiggy Jaguar experience today live on TalkRadioX.com, also Radio Zenu at RadioZenu.com. And uh, I'm going to let these guys introduce themselves. We'll talk a little bit about their uh, their exploits in the uh, entertainment industry. Gentlemen, go ahead and introduce yourselves to the lovely, lovely fine folks in radio and television land. Well, we're the Brothers Rigney. I'm Brian. This is Paul. This quiet one over here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, on a live interview. hey, how you doing? Hey, what's going on, man? <laughs> now, what is that picture behind you guys? Who, 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 did one of you guys paint that, or did you just go buy it? Um, that is a signed print. Uh, one of hobbies and we all have them, right? Is air shows, and so there's a group here out of Texas that uh, performs called Tor Tor Tor, and that's a signed print that they did for their group. Wow, that's really cool. It's a historical reenactment. That's really cool. Now tell us about your uh, your background in, uh, in, in your chosen uh, profession here with uh, all your wow. cool stuff. <laughs> wow. We've been at it a little while. Yeah. Um, I think we started when we were kids fighting over the same acoustic guitar. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I think... Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure it was mine. He'll tell you otherwise. But he's the, <laughs> the lesson <laughs> guy. <laughs> it's still in my attic. <laughs> you still have the guitar? Yes, I do. That's I do. awesome. That's I, awesome. It now, was below a Kmart special. <laughs> it's a Kmart special. Well, I hope it was a blue light special for... Uh, <laughs> For Kmart's sake. Now, uh, we have the uh, Brothers Rigney joining us today via the old Skype a Rooney. And uh, we will have a uh, live video uh, available at JiggyJaguar.net as well as on our YouTube channel as soon as uh, we get done chatting with them. Also, it, live audio is available at Radio Zenu and TalkRadioX.com. I am, of course, the proud owner of the number 49 position on the Talkers Magazine Frontier 50 because of TalkRadioX.com. Look at that. They're clapping for me. Look at this. Yes, um, I, I've been reminded several times by Antibert, the uh, PD over at Talk Radio X, that the only reason I'm on that list is because of him. Uh, <laughs> now, we've got uh, Chris Jasper from the Isley Brothers coming up here in a few moments, but we've got the uh, Brothers Rigney with us right now. Tell us about how you guys uh, how you guys make the music. How, how, how do you uh, get things together, the writing process, all these incredible things? Well, it's a it's kind of a, it's a team approach. Uh, yeah. Most often, Paul comes up with a melody, and he'll say, okay. "Hey, what does this make you think about?" And then I'll sit around and I'll go, "Hey, what do you think about this?" And then it all comes together. Um, and it, it's usually that simple, believe it or not. It, or he'll say, "Hey, you know, I was thinking about the islands writing this song," and boom, we'll sit down, we'll hammer it out, we'll share it. And <laughs> It's that simple. It really is. When there's only two of us being brothers and stuff, we've been doing it long. It's like, I had him call me from an airport go, hey, I got an idea for a song. Sing it to me over the phone and then text him back the guitar part within an hour. <laughs> That's really cool. Yeah, now, modern technology is awesome. It has allowed us to actually write when he's on the other side of the planet. Yeah. Now, what, how the hell do you end up on the other side of the planet? Is it because you're a secret spy agent guy, or what the hell's going on there? No, but like most musicians, <laughs> I have a day job. <laughs> <laughs> and my day job happens to involve getting on airplanes and going to exotic places and educating people. I don't hurt them. I educate them. <laughs> Now, uh, talk to me about some of the favorite places you guys like playing. Is there, uh, is there any particular, you know, places like, uh, would you rather play like a, an acoustic, like coffee shop type setting rather than, you know, a big concert hall or uh, fill well, me in on some of these. 
Well, you know, we're easy. We'll play almost anything. But honestly, where we've had our best success and where yeah. we enjoy it the most is the small to medium-sized venue. It's a little more intimate. We get to interact with the crowd and we get to talk with Absolutely. them. You know, because, hey, music is more than about just the song you're playing. I mean, you've got to yeah. reach out and touch people. And it's a lot easier in a small venue. <laughs> you're you're right you're right now uh tell us about the website the brothers rigney.com well we we do self-maintain the website um in fact i just posted a fresh blog today please feel free to go out and see my thoughts on creating a new album but uh we 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 maintain it through uh, a vendor a third-party vendor that keeps it up for us yeah and we post bit, we post songs there for folks, links to our Facebook, links to other musicians, etc. So pictures, you what can a, see us calendar. playing live at the food court here in Austin, Texas. Um, <laughs> so it's just a, it's all around just kind of a general, you know, video and music of what we're what we're up to. And right now, we do have three tracks from the album up there, so you can get out there, give it a listen, and you know, see what you think. Now, uh, this this in, this entire uh, new CD that's coming out very soon. Tell me about this. Uh, I notice on the Facebook page you've got uh, uh, a couple uh, pictures from the uh, from the new CD. Fill us in on this. Well, we're extremely excited. We were going to go with twelve tracks, but we just got so excited that we threw a thirteenth bonus track on it. Okay. And we went to final production this last week, so it, it is on track to be ready by the due date of September 1st is when we set for the going live of the album for the release. And uh, <laughs> so right now it's in final production where they put on all the nice little radio tags and names and just a little bit of cleanup that they do right before it goes to press. So yeah. what you're seeing on our Facebook page is pictures of the cover art. We've got a nice 3D link so you can see what it looks like and what we're doing. We're calling it out of the woods. That's cool. Now I'm looking. I, I love your, I love your Facebook page. You've got all sorts of things over here. You've got a, you've got uh, animals playing. Uh, you've got cats playing guitars, which is uh, quite entertaining. Uh, we've got uh, a picture of uh, of someone saying, "Mommy, when I grow up, I want a musician, be a musician." She says, "Well, you you have to decide. You can't be both." Uh, <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Who is this guy you've got up here that the many faces of Carlos, angry, happy, sad, confused, or <laughs> Who's this guy? Uh, Carlos is a good friend of ours who has sat in with us live when we've uh, actually occasionally played when we were in a medium sized venue where yeah. we could fit the drummer up behind us, and he's been kind enough to sit in. So, uh, Kind of a running joke because he's kind of has one speed and one look. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. Now, when you guys play, you guys are very active. It seems you guys are playing all over the place. We're yeah. getting out and about. We've had the good fortune, thanks to a little help from our friend, the parachuting Buddha, our, our agent, to get out and play in, uh, all over Texas. We've been playing Austin, San Antonio, Houston, Dallas, Fort Worth. Um, we've been managing to have some really long weekends. And That's really lot. cool. That's yeah. really cool. Now, uh, getting out there and, and, and playing live, what, what are, what are uh, some of the fan reactions and things to, to your music? Usually, wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's <laughs> good. A lot of music or anything, but when somebody... Usually, up, wow. I love that. ...is holding electric instruments, they're like... We're missing something here. <laughs> well, I'll, I'll tell you, you guys, you guys look like you're having a heck of a time. Um, when is the the, the music going to be released? When is the new the new music coming out? The album's going to be available via Facebook, CD Baby, Amazon download. You can get it in either um, hard or electronic format. Yeah, and it's going to be ready by nine one. That's cool. That's cool. Well, when, when that comes out, I definitely want to have you guys back. We'll play some of the tracks from the CD, and uh, we'll chat with you about the uh, process behind the music and everything. Absolutely. Definitely. Well, thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Thanks for making time for us today. 
See you next time. It's been a heck of a fun ride. We will talk to you soon. All right. Appreciate it, guys. Have yourself a wonderful day. If you want to get more information on these guys, check out their website. And uh, it is thebrothersrigney.com, as they say.